and welcome to our Amplified Life. Happy Friday. We are so excited that you are here with us or whatever day of the week you're watching this. We just love that you show up for us each and every week. Now, today is going to be a fun edition of our Amplified Life because we're going to talk about taking a very casual outfit and making it dressy and showing you a couple options to get your little um, outfit inspiration going. So I'm gonna start out with just what you would find me in on a day-to-day -day basis. I am in jeans and a t-shirt and I've got my little shoes here that um, I would be wearing just running around doing whatever. So jeans and a t-shirt are just an easy thing to take to the next level. Now, the first thing I would do, I would leave my cute little sneaks on but I would add a scarf to this outfit. Now, this is something that is super um, handy to have on hand. So if you have not purchased one of our scarves that are in this fantastic shape yet, you're missing out, ladies. It is wonderful. So you can see how that just immediately elevated this outfit. It took me two seconds to tie it on my neck. And I'll be able to buzz around and look just a little bit more put together than jeans and a t-shirt. Now, if I was going to take this um, to the next level and really shoosh things up here, I'm going to slip into my fun pumps that you will see in just a minute. And then I'm going to add this gorgeous, dramatic pose jacket. Now, I love yellow, so I'm going to pop this little yellow t-shirt out of the sleeve. These are a three-quarter sleeve. There's a button here, so you can actually cuff these up and show the fun little um, piping that it has there covering the seam. But this jacket is gorgeous. I'm going to add some earrings here real quick because accessories are so very important, like we talked about with the scarf. Earrings can make all the difference in the world. And Amy and I have got an accessory video coming up that's highlighting all of our jewelry that we have this season. And you'll want to watch it because truly we have got the best jewelry collection that we have ever had. And it's just a fantastic way to, well, if I could find the hole in my ear, it's a fantastic way to um, elevate your looks. All right, well, I can't. It's been a while since I wore earrings. I think that my holes closed over. We're gonna go with one earring, but look at how beautiful this works. Now, this has got painted blue baubles and then a nice antique gold. So when I step back here, you can see all of a sudden I've taken this jeans and a t shirt look and it looks completely dressy. And I've added a pop of yellow with my pump. Now, if I wanted to go full on drama, I would take this collar, pop it up, and you are ready for anything. Amy, what well, do you have for us I today? I didn't have my earrings in either, so I hurried and put mine on, so I wasn't fighting my ear holes. Now, as Rebecca said, we are taking dressy items and or excuse me, casual items and dressing them up. If you haven't checked out The Notion by Cabby, it's incredible. And this actually falls into that stop motion trend. So it's like leisure pieces, anything that's casual, like Rebecca was saying, t-shirt and jeans, amp them up. So what better casual to dressy outfit than a one and done this is our summer jumpsuit. I love that it has a little bit of back coverage, but this honestly feels like pajamas when you're wearing it. Super casual, really yummy and comfortable. It's a great travel piece. You can be comfortable on an airplane. You can be comfortable in a car. It's just fantastic. However, it can feel a little drab if you just wear it like this all the time, because we do tend to just lean into those casual pieces all the time. So why not add a fun pop of color to this? So the very first thing is I would have swapped out my flip-flops or sneaks and added this really fun high, high pop pink pump. 
The second thing that you may not know that you can do with this is although this does have a drawstring, it's really easy to hide. So if you really want to have a really fun pop of color, um, let me get this on and fix it, and then I'll show you what I do. I thought it would be really cool to add this hot pink belt. So what I'm going to do is actually only have it showing in the front. So it's almost like I've front tucked the jumpsuit, okay? So this alone, just the belt and the shoes, totally dresses this up. Now, I, I agree with Rebecca, we have some really cool jewelry. So this is our swagger necklace, has this very cool carabiner hook, carabiner hook, and it's big enough you'd think I could do it blindly, but maybe if I had the hook turned the right direction. So you can have this chunky fun necklace, add that to it, but you know me, I always get cold in a restaurant or anything else. So grab that sweater and cape it over your shoulders just to pull the whole thing together. And then later that night, or if you are colder, you can add this sweater over top of it and front tuck it into the belt. So you're still showing the outfit, you're still drawing the eye up and you just took your summer jumpsuit from your run around all day long and your sneaks and flip flops to maybe a day out with the girls. So I hope you enjoyed this take on the summer jumpsuit. I would love to see you guys do something with it fun, but let's check out and see what Rebecca has that next. pop of pink is something else. All right, so I am starting off here with a very casual outfit. This is leggings and a tank top, ladies. So I have our Paragon tank in this fantastic gray and then the runway legging in gray again. So we've got a column of color and say you just finished your workout or you're headed to yoga and you know that you've got errands that you need to run after you finish. Wear this for yoga, have our um, take five topper handy. That's gonna add just a little bit extra uh, warmth, but this baby is so darn comfortable. It is really, really stretchy and <clears throat> it feels like you're wearing your most favorite sweatshirt, but you're dressed up. So just by adding, let me add it here for you to see the visual. So just by adding this little jacket, You suddenly have a put together look. You can wear it with tinnies or you can take another like fun espadrille or another wedge and wear it like that. And you'll be really put together to run your errands. Now, another fun take on this that I wanted to show you, if you wanted to just take this to the next level. So this is like maybe stage two and we're going to, take it off the charts with this next look. First of all, we're going to add two of our necklaces. So we've got a great stack of necklaces here and I'm going to bring them up a little closer so you can see them. So you've got just a nice, really dressy look just in and of itself, taking this basic gray tank. The magic of accessories always blows my mind. It's absolutely phenomenal. Then I'm going to take our Athena dress and layer that over the top. So, and we've got this with our leggings. Now, you've got a couple fun options for shoes here. If you want to go and play off of the blue, then pop them with some blue. But you know me, I like to kind of shake things up a little bit. And I thought it would be fun to bring in this wonderful orange to really kind of stand out. We've got cute shoes. We may as well show them off, right? And that's one of the easiest ways to do it is to have a nice, bright, bold shoe in kind of an otherwise, you know, you've got a gray base here, so very neutral. And I really feel like this dress is pretty neutral. Maybe not for everybody, but beautiful, beautiful option. 
I just have to show you one other layer piece that just completely steps this jumpsuit out of the box. With that same pop of color, I just simply added our prep school shirt. So you have that same coverage, the drapiness. It's one of my favorites, and it would work with any of these as well. Okay, so you've heard us talk about columns over and over and over. And when it comes to casual wear, Kebby is really, really fantastic about giving us sets, which actually is a column. So Rebecca just talked to you about two gray separates. My one and done is a column, but I wanted to move on to one of my favorite Lux Leisure pieces of all times. And my clients have seen me wear this a lot at my shows is our easy everyday lounger. This is just drapey, yummy fabric. I love the big waistband because it allows me to wear it right up on my true waist. Or if I feel a little like more casual and I want them a little slouchy, I can do that as well. So speaking of sets, you can see these two tops that somebody may gravitate to for more of that casual look. You've got our wing top that's a cute little tank top. And then you have that monochromatic look in the trooper tee. Now, either one of these tops would work with the next two layers um, that I'm showing you, or even just with the prep school shirt that I'm showing you. But since we are talking about amping up casual pieces, I'm actually gonna just push those aside because I'm going to pull in a poly top um, and really show you how incredible this dress is up. So I simply swapped out the casual tops for our flammo top. It can read as a floral or as a camo, which is why it's called flammo. And it has this gorgeous peplum detailing all the way around. It is a standout piece. It really looks fantastic on the body. It's thin enough, you can choose. Do you want it tucked in all the way? Do you want it front tucked so you can see the peplum in the back? Or are you going to just leave it out? So any way you do it, that peplum really adds and draws the eye up. Now, Rebecca talked about our gorgeous jewelry and I love the stackable pearl and gold piece that we have here. And of course we need a layering piece. Oh, I mean, this is <laughs> sneeze. I think that might be the first for our amplified live, just me sneezing live on camera. Okay, but maybe you work in an office and want something a little more um, office appro appropriate. I pulled in our window pane jacket for this and it's totally, you could wear this in an office all day long and be super, super comfortable. But I also wanted to show you how beautiful taking our retro cardigan, especially with these pearls, and even leaving a little bit of that peplum hanging out and amping it up with these two pieces. So depending on your lifestyle, depending on if you're working or maybe just a day date, maybe you're a sweater person versus a jacket person. I just wanted to show you two options and I cannot wait to see you guys in some of these pieces. So as Rebecca said, we do have several episodes coming up and we're so excited about it. So stay tuned, be sure you subscribe, share these videos with your girlfriends. You can always watch them in two times the speed if you just want to catch something or maybe you've already watched it and want to go back and rewatch. We have so much content on this channel. We would love for you to share it. But in the next upcoming um, episodes, stay tuned because we are going to be talking about accessories. We are going to be talking um, conversations. We have had a lot of fun with those. And in the next couple of weeks, we are going to be talking about one thing Rebecca and I had no idea we had in common until we found out, and that is home renovations and upkeeping your houses. So that will be kind of an interesting conversation. And we have so much more. Also, summer is coming and we may even need to take a second look at the makeup and the colorways we're wearing for summer. So stay tuned. We have a lot coming up and we will see you. Soon.